Republican representatives Marjorie Taylor Greene and Liz Cheney apparently got into a shouting match in the House of Representatives on Thursday afternoon, according to Democratic Representative Jamie Raskin. And the way Raskin tells the story is he was sitting there talking to Liz Cheney. And this was shortly after the vote to hold Bannon in contempt. So he's chatting it up with Liz Cheney. Suddenly Marjorie Taylor Greene decides to come up and start yelling at Liz Cheney. And Liz Cheney starts yelling back. Raskin says he's not exactly sure what, you know, they started yelling about in the first place, but he does know that at one point it got onto the subject of the uh, so-called Jewish space lasers that earlier this year, it was revealed that Marjorie Taylor Greene subscribes to the conspiracy theory that the campfire wildfire in the state of California in 2018, the worst in state's history was somehow started by the elites using a uh, space laser to start the blaze. So two, two members of the house of representatives in a shouting match over Jewish space lasers starting a massive wildfire in California three, three years ago. Um, can we all agree at this point that these aren't people that we should be taking seriously, that it's a damn shame. These people are even a part of our government. I just keep picturing anybody else that doesn't live in the United States reading us news and seeing a headline like this. Like, what do they think of us? I mean, really, I would love to know the international opinion of lunatics like Marjorie Taylor Greene pushing ridiculously insane conspiracy theories about space lasers. Or, hey, how about the fact that our former president before he left office thought the little smart thermostats could somehow be changing votes? We're a nation of idiots. And unfortunately we're giving those idiots, the biggest idiots among us seats of power instead of shunning them, we're elevating them. That's terrifying. That truly is terrifying, but nobody is more terrifying to be honest than Marjorie Taylor Greene. She has made her colleagues fearful that she is going to physically hurt them. We have had reports of that over this year. We have the video of her going to AOC's office before she was even an elected official, Marjorie Taylor Greene, and harassing her, yelling through the mail slot and then laughing to the camera like the Joker from The Dark Knight. She has been reported to chase Democrats down the hallway, screaming at them. And now we have reports of her getting into a screaming match with a member of her own party, Liz Cheney. What's it going to take? And I know the answer for, for the Republicans in the house to finally say enough is enough. You guys could band together with the Democrats and vote to expel her. I promise you Marjorie Taylor Greene is not doing your party any favors, All right? She herself is hemorrhaging money. You have seven candidates lined up to challenge her in next year's midterms already. People hate her. She might be loved in her district, but who gives a damn? That's a deep red district. Anyway, you could slap a frog on the ballot with an R next to its name and it's going to win. You don't have to worry about losing that seat to the Democrats. So kick her goofy ass out of the house and maybe restore a little bit of integrity to that chamber.